Okay guys, so we're still on the uh, last of K and uh, what are we doing today? We are gonna go spur fishing. Yay! Oh, take a chance, will you let me ride? I could be the best thing in your life. Maybe let's take a drive, take a drive. It's been so long. Let's hope we find a good spot with some fish. As my lungs are getting better, try and spare fish again. Yeah, and uh, Jan has some new fins. We've got some new wetsuits. We're gonna test all of that. It's gonna be fun. And we actually made some friends, so we're gonna go and do all of that with them. We don't know how much there is to fish here in Vlasov because, I mean, it's a spot quite close to Cairns and there's mooring boys here, meaning that a lot of people come here. So usually that tends to not be the better spot. But if it's not very good, then we might go to Arlington after. We'll see. Uh, but it would be cool if we could stay here because then that's less time traveling and more time enjoying the water. And we are on the boy, so we're gonna sleep peacefully. So today we are meeting with our friends on their lovely boat called Dodger. So we're all gonna take their dinghy and go into this area close to their boat, which we thought might contain a lot of fish, so good for snorkel, good for spare fishing. I mean, we don't really know, but we'll try our luck there. We'll see. What we got? Yum! Oh, hey. <laughs> yum! You salty bread, the Dean, and Cecile, my fellow snorkel buddy. <laughs> Hi, guys! What did you catch? <laughs> I didn't catch anything because I couldn't reload my gun. <laughs> no so, uh, um, when we had it repaired, let me show you. The rubber was here in the first place and I moved it to that spot. And because it's further away, I couldn't reach it. <laughs> so I couldn't reach it to actually reload. So I just swapped it from here to here. And now I'm just adjusting so it's in the middle. But yeah, I couldn't reload, <laughs> which is a shame. And I hope that's enough. Or if not, maybe the rubber is not the same length, or I don't know. Let's hope with that adjustment, now we can reload it. So, um, could it be yeah. because it's too new? It could be because it's too new, but uh, I could barely reach it. So I didn't have a proper grab to, to reload. So um, I think a little bit of both, but mainly because, yeah, it was too far from me. So I couldn't reach. So um, I'm going to adjust it so it's in the middle. By just spreading it around and moving it. it looks good now. And yeah, 
All right, let's hope for the best next time. Yeah, definitely. Such a shame. Like I was ready to actually catch a fish and, and try it out. Like this new shaft and everything, new rubber. Not for today. And how is uh, your lung capacity feeling? So the lung is actually not good at all. So I've done like five or six um, breast holding and I was not holding for long and I was out of breath after um, like five or six times like I couldn't um, do much sport after that so I had to go to the tender and then catch my breath for a little bit and then I could go around a bit more after that but um, yeah it's not good so I really hope after a bit of training it's gonna be better well we just have to tell the fish not to go too deep <laughs> yeah and not to move and just be there and wait for us yeah yeah but even if they do that I cannot reload the gun. <laughs> so let's hope first I can reload the gun and then we can try and catch some fish. Okay, snorkel was nice, uh, but now we need lunch and obviously we still have a lot of fish. So we're going to go over to our friend's boat and uh, we're going to share the love a bit. So we're bringing fish and they'll probably cook some veggies to go with and yeah, share a nice meal. We ended up spending the rest of the afternoon on their boat and after that decided all to go to the beach because some other people were there. So we thought it would be nice to meet up. Yeah, it looks like there's a meetup. So we're going to join the feast. Meet up on the beach. Yep. Let's go! I got a feeling That this could be a little more than feelings If I'm being honest Honestly you got me where you want it You got me playing every card And spending all my time Trying to find out more about you Cause I really want you in my space Picking up every call Falling all my money's on you I never knew I needed love Needed love, needed love I always thought I'd be enough Be enough, be enough You show me what it means to see Outside of me God knows what I'd be missing Now I really need your love Need your love, need your love So we are up early this morning because it's a beautiful day, there's almost no wind, the sun is here, so we're gonna do our first dive of the year. Um, we're gonna have to test all our BCD and everything, all diving equipment, make sure everything is good. So we figured out today is a, it's a pretty good day to do so. So we're gonna head over to our friend's boat and um, the four of us are gonna uh, do a dive. We find not too far away, like three to four miles away from where we are anchored, a spot where it goes from two meters to maybe 25 to 30 meters deep. So let's see if there is a lot to see in there. Uh, we just know it's the right spot to dive. That's not very deserted. It was yesterday. First, wait. Why should I wait? <laughs> um, which I don't really remember how much I need. And even if I did remember, I mean, you know, it was three years ago, it was with different um, wetsuit and everything, so I'll probably, I'm probably going to need to test it again. Which is a bit annoying, but that's part of diving. It's fine, that's why we do this dive. It's not a difficult one at all. So, yeah. So, I'm gonna put three on, leave the fourth one on the boat, and see if I need it. I never knew I need a love, need a love, need a love. I always thought I'd be enough, be enough, be enough. You show me what it means to see outside of me. God knows what I'd be missing Now I really need your love, need your love, need your love
diving. Any diving? We're looking for spots. Yep. Nice spots. Our dinghy is being dragged. And the water is really nice here. We are trying to find a spot to anchor in. I hope we find a good spot to anchor in. nice there weren't that many like wildlife or whatever but the coral was beautiful so and it was nice just to you know dive again and get all of those sensation back so yeah it was really nice um equipment wise so those bottles they weren't filled the guys at the shop told us they filled them but uh, clearly that wasn't true uh thankfully our friends had uh two spare tanks so we could use that and then Jan has a bit of an issue with his um, regulator because it's jammed. It should be easy enough to fix, but uh, yeah, in the meantime, our friends also had the spare, so we could use that. Um, that was really nice of them. And yeah, now a bit less fun, but this afternoon we need to clean the bottom of the holes in the water. So let's dive in, I guess. I never knew I needed love, needed, yes, I need your love. Wow, on top of not being a fun activity, I also got sea lice. It's a skin irritation that's caused by the trapping of small jellyfish larvae under my shirt. The pressure causes them to release inflammatory cells and this is the result. Look at this, beautiful. Ugh. It's everywhere. Sad? Yeah, it's itchy. I want to scratch real bad.
Well, that was our last day on the reef. Tomorrow we are heading back to Cairns because there's some bad weather coming. So that's it for us this week. If you liked the video, make sure to give it a thumbs up because it really helps us. And don't forget to subscribe and to hit that notification bell. See you next week. Bye.